Time for another unboxing your mail. Please note that my PO box is open, but we're not going to check it too often. So please, if you do want to send something, first of all, make sure you're wearing a mask, make sure that you are safe, make sure that your area isn't pretty much full blown not safe. So please, 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 please make sure that you are safe before you do go out and also send it on the slowest way possible because mail delivery services are taking forever. All I'm saying is don't feel like you need to send things too quickly nor too expensively. Just take your time and stay safe. That is the most important thing ever, please. With that said, I do have quite a few packages that I have to go through and I still have a backlog, I think. Hang on, let's see where these are from. These are since December. That's how behind I am. <laughs> Normally I'm not this behind, but do expect about a two to three month delay before I unbox anything at this point. So you know what I'm gonna say. The normal Canadian thing, I'm sorry. So we're going to start with this mystery box. I have no idea who it's from, nor where it's from. There's no name on top. It was just sent to my PO box. So let's see what we get inside. By the way, for those of you new to this channel, this is my second channel, Nerdy Jackie. My main channel is Nerdy Crafter. So make sure that you check that channel because it's more exciting. There's a lot more going on on that channel and I have over a million subscribers on that one. This is my littler, my littler channel. Okay, so all we see in here is fluff. Oh, oh, I know who this is from. So I have Spectrum Noirs. These are new products by Spectrum, Spectrum Noir for the sketching enthusiasts. So this here is Bonita. And Bonita contacted me through Twitter and Instagram, I believe. And Kara, I know Kara too. Oh, I love these two. So I have these two new products, which I will be using just to kind of play around with. So maybe I'll draw something in another vlog video where we could just hang out and I'll also use these because I'm super excited. So these products not only have the markers, but there's also a how-to guide. This is exciting. I follow Kara, by the way, on TikTok and Bonita on, I believe, Instagram and Twitter. I'll leave their information down below. Oh, that is exciting. I had totally forgotten about these because of everything that's been going on. So Bonita, thank you so much. I'm going to message you right away to let you know that I did receive them. So I love markers and new things. I love them so much. So next vlog, we'll be unboxing these together. And then this package is from Amazon. You grains are clever. I know that many of you just send me stuff straight from Amazon and you put a note in there, which is super thoughtful. And also it saves you money from, you know, having to pay too much for shipping because Amazon is pretty cheap when it comes to shipping. So that's, that's pretty clever. Ooh, oh no, oh no. <laughs> I know what this is. Let me find the note first. Okay, this is from Mimi, Gordon, and Caroline from Quebec, and it says, first or second surprise for our favorite YouTuber who's made our family quarantine more interesting. Thank you, Infinitely, Angel, and Sika are perfect psychics. They're the same person. By the way, this was fully written in French. I pretty much tried to translate it. Oh, and it says, a little something for Salty Crafter to be reviewed with Sika only. Interesting. Okay. Okay. This is really cool. I'm really curious what we're going to have that's going to be with Sika only because they kind of put everything together. Oh, no. oh, this is going to be so interesting. So this is a clay extruder. And for those of you who don't know, a clay extruder is pretty much where you put in clay and you turn it. But the good thing is this has actually has a swivel and you can push out different shapes. If you haven't seen a clay extruder, there's a video of what a clay extruder does. So I have one, but I've never tried this brand. So this is gonna be very interesting. And then, see, this is where I'm like, mm. <laughs> I don't know how I feel. We have a grow your own crystal mini world. Now, the only issue with this and having to do it with Sika is that these things take days, if not weeks, to grow. But I'll definitely go through this. And if it's something that's doable within a few hours, for sure, Sika and I will grow it. But if it requires a few days, it looks like I'll have to be on my own for it. Or maybe I'll grow the crystals before. Maybe that, th there's, there's always a way. 
So thank you so much for these craft kits. The crystal ones always make me worry just because it always scares me taking so long to make a video. But I'll do it for your pleasure. And now this super colorful package. This one is from Milliard from, I believe, Ontario. So fellow Canadian and it says you're doing it wrong. There are so many absolutely wonderful stickers. You brains know I love stickers so much. Cycling bin right over there. Ooh, looks like it's going to be a lot of drawings. <gasps> oh, there seems to be a couple of surprises in here too. And I found the note. This note is from Maddie, who is in the third grade, who turned nine in May. So happy belated birthday. I wish I had gotten that sooner so I could say happy birthday in the future, but now it's now it's a belated birthday. And Maddie's favorite moments are English number ones which happens a lot. Their favorite series is Thrift Store Makeover, and they love Angel Verb, who doesn't? And Maddie also sent me some bracelets, which are a perfect fit. Thank you so much, Maddie. And I also have some squishy papers, and one that says Nerdy Crafter, and a bunch of amazing artwork that is very relevant to what we do on this channel. There's my little hat. Here's little me with my merch of Insulted. We also get my beanie in a different style. We have a cute rainbow. This reminds me a lot of Mariah Elizabeth, but it says even the rainbow is telling me you're doing it wrong. Why rainbow? Why you gotta do me like that? <laughs> get some more you're doing it wrong this time from my own beanie even my beanie's gotta do me like that we have an octopus with a salt shaker and it's pretty salty and it's saying the same thing you're doing it wrong maddie i'm starting to think that maybe your favorite thing isn't english number one your favorite thing is that i'm doing it wrong that's the impression i'm getting another octopus and this time the salt shaker is much Closer. And last but not least, we have an octopus with my beanie. I'm really curious, what is your favorite animal, Maddie? Is it an octopus? I think it might be. That's your favorite creature. Thank you so much, Maddie, for sending me these lovely pictures. Now from Texas, we have a letter from Marley, I believe, and it does feel like there's a frame in there. So I'm pretty excited to see what is framed. Luckily, I don't hear anything broken, so please be careful. If you're going to send anything, make sure that it's plexiglass, so it's like a plastic, or just downright plastic, that's fine too. Ooh, that's pretty well covered. Is there a note? Yes, let's get to the note first. So this letter is from Rebecca, and Rebecca says that this is the first time that they write to a YouTuber. It feels very weird. I Still don't consider myself a YouTuber, but I think that's my title now because it is what it is. And Rebecca said that she really felt like painting and apparently I was the inspiration and they sent it to me. And also apparently I was the reason they started their channel. Please, Rebecca, I hope I can find your channel name somewhere so that I can link it down below. Let me know. If you see me unboxing this, I want to know your channel. Oh my god, a painting. This is so exciting. You grains are so talented and I love receiving things that you've handmade. This is really a huge Ziploc. Why am I so impressed with the Ziploc? Because I love resealable bags, that's why. And, oh, the back part fell, and, oh, no! Oh my god, that is really awesome. I have legitimately goosebumps right now. That is amazing. For those of you who don't know, one of my favorite characters of all time right behind me is All Might from the series My Hero Academia. And Rebecca drew me with All Might in both his muscled form and in his decrepit form, which is my favorite. I really love him like this. And this is a selfie painting portrait. That is absolutely wonderful. The colors are so vibrant. I love that this is gonna go on my background. Really need a more stable background. I think I'm gonna change my channel background. Let me know if you grains are okay with that. Sometimes it's just fun to change things up, so I might actually move things around just to kind of have more of your stuff in the back. That makes sense? I don't know why my hands are doing this, but they're doing it. Thank you so much, Rebecca. This must have taken some time and quite a few layers of paint. This is so pigmented. Thank you so much. I love it. I'm in love. All might. I love them. And now we have, I don't know if I can hide. I'm just going to blur it. This package here is from Laura from Ohio. How do I open this? I am not the most tactful, nor am I the most gentle, and I never pretended I was. Be clear about that. I have a note. 
And the instructions are pretty clear. It says insert sharp pointy thing at corner. Not sure which corner, but I will just insert a sharp pointy thing. Like so. Voila. I love it when you grains give me instructions. And, wait. And this letter is from Laura, whose Instagram name is Iki Neko. I hope I'm saying it right, but I know you. I've seen your nickname. I try to heart as many comments and I get to know your grains by your nicknames and your Insta names. Don't change them. The second you change your Instagram names, I lose you and I feel like I can't find you again. Don't do that. That's why I tell my students, if you start sitting somewhere, don't start changing your seats. And Laura has been watching on both the Nerdy Crafter and Nerdy Jackie channel. And Laura remembers that I do have an allergy to metals, which is true. I used to have piercings and they used to always get infected. So I stopped wearing any kind of piercing whatsoever. And so Laura made this for me. I'm gonna look at it after. That is made out of resin, plastic, and glass beads. And the beads don't even go all the way around so they don't get tangled in my hair. That is very, very thoughtful because things always get stuck and it hurts when beads are like tangled in your hair and it just goes like everywhere and then you end up doing this. <laughs> Laura is also a fell it fell it fell fell fellow. Fellow sausage finger person. And don't worry, please grains, know that it has nothing to do with whether something is simple or complex, whether it takes talent, or whether it just takes the fact that you've spent time on it. I love receiving things from you grains. Again, whether it's an item or even a handwritten letter, it means the world to me. I know some of you type because you don't like your own handwriting. Trust me, I understand because my handwriting is like chicken scratch. But just being able to have something from you grains makes me feel that much closer to you. And when you send me something, I have boxes and boxes full of your letters that I keep and read anytime I doubt myself or feel down. Your letters pick me up. So thank you for that. I'm looking at the boxes. That's that's what I'm like. If you see my eye going there, so I'm looking at the boxes. I'm looking at the letters. I'm looking at the drawings you send me. So please don't think about plexity or anything like that. Just having a letter or something. This means the world to me. With that said, I did read also the other side and I wish I could hug you grains. It's unfortunate that these things are happening now because now I'm thinking if I ever bump into you grains outside as the world is right now, I can't hug you because we would be both at risk. So I really just, Grr. this world is, is, is a funny thing. That is pretty. So it reminds me of a licorice candy. My favorite flavor is licorice. Salty licorice too. I swear I'm not doing that on purpose. I've loved licorice ever since I was a little grain. My siblings hated it, so they always gave me these candies. Any licorice types, I took them. I love them. And this one definitely reminds me of licorice candy and the beads. Absolutely pretty. This would go well with one of the outfits that I have. I don't go out very often and my outfits, they're not very adult-like, but I do like accessories that are easy going is what I'm trying to say. I, I really need a new wardrobe. It's like most of my wardrobe is pajamas and t-shirts. Let me know in the comment section below, what is your majority wardrobe? Is it mostly hoodies? Is it mostly pajama pants, t-shirts? I'm curious. Now we have an envelope from Amber in Idaho. Are Idaho potatoes as good as they say it is? Or do they kind of taste the same? Oh, oh what? We have an awesome arty warrior. So I, <laughs> did I just call myself awesome? I think I did, but that's okay, that's okay. So here's a picture of me holding the sharp pointy thing and it says onward mighty burb, there's craftery to do. <laughs> I love this. I love the fact that Angel has an insignia right on top and what's going on down here. And Sika needs snacks. And on the other side, it just has her laughing because She's really into it. I absolutely love this so much, Amber. Thank you so much. It says you're old age fan. I don't think so. Trust me, most of us are, are pretty much the same age. I absolutely love it. It's gonna be in the background. I have two places where I put my art. If they can stand alone, I put them in the back. If they're loose leaf sheets that can stand alone, I have a whole board over there in the back that I can pin them to. So I think I need a bigger board though. And now a letter from Lily. And this one is from 
school. Now I do receive letters from some of you grains that go to school. I have sent a couple of them back. However, with schools have with, with schools being closed, English cooperate, please. I need to enunciate my words. I don't know if they're going to arrive to you, Grains, so I'm not sure if there's a way for me to communicate and let you know, but those of you who have written anything since September, I have replied back. So if your school has it, they have it. If they don't, please know that I did receive and I did read it, and I, I am really appreciative that you are taking the time to write to me. And Lily says, that this is a school project to write to role models. I don't think I'm a role model, I can't even, I can't even talky talky, but I do appreciate it. Lily found my channel through the collab that I did with Delightful a few years ago. Has it been a few years? Holy moly, time flies. And they say that my videos, including the craziness and fun, is something that they really enjoy, despite the fact that they know that my family and I have been through hardships. But I really do want to make you green smile, and you are absolutely right about that, Lily. And yes, I agree that Sika doubles the craziness on the channel, so I try to have her anytime I can. Next, we have a letter from Alicia, and it was sent in December. The apology is just gonna stay for, for a long time. And Alicia sends me happy birthdays. Thank you so much. Yes, my birthday is in December. I think we're halfway there anyways at this point, so might as well start the birthday wishes. And their birthday is also on the 29th of December. So we're both December babies. In the envelope, we also have a letter from Alicia's niece, so we're going to go through this letter as well. And they both watch my channel along with their entire family, including their dad, Frank. Alicia, I definitely know what it's like to have a bad back, and yes, 100% staying in bed does help a lot, so make sure that you do take care of that back. My, mine is also like that too. And from Alicia's niece, I hope I'm saying the name right, Nevea. I hope. If I didn't say it right, then that means I'm doing it wrong. And Nevea says that they have four dogs. Their name is Bear Bear, Roxy, Izzy, and Penny. Oh, that is really cool. So Nevea's name is Heaven Backwards. That is really cool. And Nevea is in second grade. And they say that they love to learn and go to school. I absolutely love learning. It's one of my favorite things. Taking the time to really learn about things that you enjoy is one of the best things ever. And here is the drawing that Nevea made for me. Next is a letter from Samantha sent back in February and I believe Samantha is from Missouri. I have the note and Samantha says that she watches with her best friend but her best friend doesn't want her name to be said so you are anonymous. And they also drew me a picture that is a coloring page that is going to be fun to see. And they said that every time I post, it makes them laugh, so they do enjoy watching. And they said, when you're a grain, you come in like a hurricane. No crap kits, it says. Crapola. <laughs> this is really cute. I love the details where it says, feet Sika. And then my hands are there and it says, sausage fingers. And it says, I'll wave a sharp pointy thing at you. We have so many details on this drawing. I love it, especially my sausage fingers. Cause look, they're pretty scrumptious, probably quite juicy. <laughs> And a small note from the anonymous best friend. Hi, me and my mom love your channel, so I made a coloring page for you. Hope you enjoy. So here's the coloring page where again it says hashtag feed Sika. We have Nyan Cat. And it says hi and then cough and then salt. Yeah, I always cough salt. It's nothing else. Every time I cough, it's exclusively salt. Thank you so much to everyone who took the time to send me something. If you want to watch more vlogs on my nerdy vlog, make sure you check it over here. Until then, I will see you grains in the next video.